angioplasty. Why does your doctor want you to have angioplasty? Your heart is a muscle. Like all muscles, it needs a supply of nutrients and oxygen to function properly. Blood in the coronary arteries provides these nutrients and oxygen to your heart. Angioplasty is a procedure that can improve blood flow in coronary arteries. Improving blood flow can improve heart function. Opening a blockage can minimize heart damage and even save your life. How is angioplasty done? During angioplasty, you will be awake but given medicine to help you relax. A small area of your leg, arm, or neck will be cleaned and then numbed. Through this area, a needle, wire, and then a small flexible tube called a catheter is inserted into a blood vessel. Dye, injected through the catheter, shows up on x-ray. This helps your doctor guide the catheter to your heart and into the coronary arteries. When the blockage is reached, a balloon on the catheter is inflated. Sometimes a small tube called a stent is also placed. The balloon and stent open the coronary artery, allowing blood to flow again. Are there any risks with angioplasty? Passing anything through your skin and into a blood vessel carries a small risk of infection. It is unlikely, but the catheter could injure the blood vessel anywhere along its path. The dye could cause an allergic reaction and very rarely cause damage to the kidneys. At the heart, the catheter can cause irregular heartbeats. They usually resolve, but a temporary pacemaker could be needed. Finally, a very rare but serious complication is rupture of the coronary artery when inflating the balloon, which can only be repaired by surgery. Of course, any procedure involving the heart is risky, and even death could occur. However, over a million people in the United States have angioplasty each year with very few complications. What precautions are taken during angioplasty? To avoid infection, sterile technique is used, and the doctor wears sterile gloves, gown, and a mask. The risk of bleeding and blood vessel injury is minimized by the use of special x-rays and dye. These help your doctor safely guide catheter placement and greatly minimizes the risk of damage and irregular heartbeats. If you have a complication from dye or the catheter, your doctor is prepared to immediately address the problem and treat it. While you're having the PTCA, you will be placed on a heart monitor, oxygen, and have an IV. There's also a nurse with your doctor to monitor you while you're having the PTCA. Are there any alternatives to angioplasty? If you have a narrowing of a coronary artery, there is no other proven way to widen it. If you have a complete blockage, then heart cells are dying. The sooner angioplasty is completed, the more of your heart muscle will be saved. Some medications can open the blockage, but these are less effective than angioplasty. Do you consent to having angioplasty? While there are rare but serious risks with coronary angioplasty, your doctor believes the advantages of improving blood flow through your coronary arteries far outweighs any risks. Now that you understand why coronary angioplasty is done, how it will be done, and the possible risks and complications, your doctor needs your consent to proceed.